Ned Meat here from the Clan Elias, bringing you three stars from our Clan Wars. Uh, yeah, so the next one I'm going to bring you from this war is from Master Owen P. Morgan. Uh, yeah, cool. So looking at the composition on the bottom there, we can see it's pretty much he's got himself a standard um, a Goho. Um, so uh, quite heavy on the hogs that we can see. So he's got 26 hogs. He's got a, a golem in the clan castle and a golem out front as well. He's got 10 wizards, 8 wall breakers, and uh, a few uh, archers to assist on the anchoring, but then also clean up as well. Uh, you can see also he hasn't gone for a jump spell. He's gone for four. Um, the main reason for that is what we can see is that if you look on this side, you can actually see the, the Archer Queen's right on the edge there. The Archer Queen is the main thing with the Goho that you're actually trying to take out. Obviously, if possible, you can take out some giant bombs. That's also an additive, and you can see there's a couple of spaces there. There's also a couple of spaces up there. There's one space in the middle there, but there's also the Tesla that have got to go in there as well. So whatever happens, just by looking at this base, you can see that there's, there isn't going to be any double giant bombs, and that's where the worry comes. Um, so because the Archer Queen's on the edge there, that means that he can actually just push in a little bit on that right-hand side there, the 3 o'clock side there, just to take out the Archer Queen. And apart from that, his hogs have pretty much got a free run going through. So uh, that's the thinking behind that. So let's, let's watch this back. Uses a hog at the bottom there at the 4 o'clock to lure. And then his poison spell to take out mainly the balloon, but also to damage the, the, the dragon, pretty much takes the dragon down to half life. Um, so yeah. Here comes the anchoring with the arc with the with an archer. And then at this point here, then to distract the dragon, he then puts his golem down whilst then getting the, the, the wizards down as well. Wasn't expecting the Tesla to be at that bottom there, but actually still no problem at all because all that, all that we're there, he's doing is actually just, you know, wanting to open things up and to distract a little bit as well. So there we go. The, so now you can see that the... The, the Barb King moves in to take out the Archer Queen, and at this point, he's then going to start his his hog attack. Coming in the top, those top defences were all distracted by the um, by his uh, kill squad. So it's very good, well, very good positioning of the heal spell there in front of the hog, so that he's getting maximum positioning. Uh, even at this point here, you can see the hogs are still in the heal spell while they're taking out that. Um, AD. There was a giant bomb at the top there, but he did very well to follow up very quickly with um, with a heal spell. And obviously, I mean, in this situation, look, he's got a heal spell already over the defences, and he's still got one left. So it's just absolute overkill. Um, those hogs are going to be all um, fresh and healthy by the end of finishing off the defences. And ready to move into cleanup as soon as the Barb Kings go down. That pretty much leaves the cleanup to go. There we go. I'll speed up that. Always a nerve wracking situation here as the town hall is going to be the last <laughs> the last thing, but lucky enough you still have plenty of time and lots of hogs to get in there. Cool. Well done, Mr. Owen P. Morgan, for that one. Good stuff. Cool. So, um, yeah, do subscribe, like, and comment. Um, ask any questions. Um, share as well if there's anyone in your clan who you think can benefit from these videos. We've got over 100 videos up, all three starring Town Hall 8s, 9s, and 10s. Um, so, yeah, cool. Hope you enjoyed it.